has always had a passion for football, but playing here wasn't always the plan. I was about five years old, and my dad used to travel a lot for work, and he went up to San Francisco, and uh, he picked up a, a little 49ers helmet, and eventually I ended up like running into a wall. He takes off running top speed and hits the wall, and it's this loud boom, and Hence where he got his nickname, uh, lady in the uh, daycare center was like, oh, he's such a little bruiser. My dad was like, oh, we're going to sign you up for football because of that, and I, I kept playing ever since. Starting off in a Pop Warner football league, Brew played in Palos Verdes all the way through 8th grade. I started playing Pop Warner in probably 2007, played till I was like 12, 13 years old, so about five years, and uh, all my friends came from Palos Verdes, and uh, we all grew up together, hung out. But after his eighth grade year, Brew and his parents decided to make a drastic change. When it came to like the idea of repeating eighth grade and like starting this whole new path for me, I mean, it was kind of like laid out in front of me, like the whole idea, and I was opposed to it at first, but I ended up playing for this team called the Inland Empire Ducks, and it was basically like a team full of the best players you can find. He told me, he's like, I want to play for the IE Ducks, and I'm like, Brew, you realize that's in Riverside? We live in the South Bay, dude. I'm, I'm not driving all the way out to Riverside every day. And he's like, five minutes later, the coach calls me. We won the national championship. I mean, no, no team could compete with us. Half the team now is um, all receiving D1 offers. One tough choice followed another as Brew decided to attend Modern Day instead of his local high school in Palos Verdes. In choosing Modern Day, coming off the Ducks, I mean, a lot of it had to do with like the teammates and the people surrounding me. Also, going back to PV, I would have had to join the same grade that I was in prior to, to staying back. At the time, my wife and I were totally against it. We're like, dude, it's an hour away. How are you gonna get there? We can't drive you every day. But his decision to sacrifice his old life changed his football career forever. My wife and I went through the recruiting process. You would get letters. You get a phone call. Our first call we ever got was an offer. You know, hey, we want your son to come play football here. And I'm like, my son? I currently have 23 offers from schools. Like, I mean, my first one being Oregon, and then USC, UCLA, Cal, Alabama, um, a lot of a lot of different schools across the country. Regardless of what his future may hold, Brew is always ready to take the next leap of faith. For Student Television Network, I'm Dawson Michelle. Football is something that's not permanent and that one day it's going to end, so my life isn't focused around being successful in football. It's about being successful as like a man and a person, so go big or go home.